Remember when we used to do shows hungover, hungover and, and the we were shows. like, these are the be easily the best shows, yeah. which now I think we've mastered the sober ones. I yeah. think it, maybe we just used to do so many hungover mm. and most of our shows are good that we were like, wow, weird. Like statistically, it was, it was an excuse, yeah. an excuse to, <laughs> to, to be hungover. Yeah. I, I hate drinking. I got hungover the other day and uh, I, I- Wait, 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 what? I got hungover the other day. I was on vacation. Hit what him. Did, Hit you, him. What's going on? Hit him, man. Where did you go on vacation? Uh, the other day. Where'd you go? Where'd you, yeah, where'd you go? Just for context, vacations, the ranch, and Coachella, he's allowed to drink. Other times, 2020, sober. Well, yeah, it's sober. Ask him. Let's talk about it. Uh, well, where'd you go uh, on vacation? We went to a restaurant. Where was that? Uh, uh, Beverly Hills. And you were hungover <laughs> after the, going to the restaurant. Yeah, I was on vacation. Mm, what part about it was a vacation, my friend? Uh, all right. Well, so because I thought I I know, I know what you're thinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And I thought the same thing as you. I was like, I was yeah. like, Va vacation, right? We, well, let's yeah. look it up. Okay, look it up. The fine, the fine vacation. Yeah. So check it out. Uh, an extended period of leisure and recreation, especially one spent away from home or in traveling. <laughs> so I wasn't home. <laughs> and I was, it was it was recreational. So yeah, I took a took a couple. This of is this is where like the logical Logan Paul sucks. Like, oh, let me the find worst. the, the, the one loophole in my entire disciplinary, like, act on myself to make it okay for me to drink one night. That sucks, man. I'm Whatever. Like, drink a drink, but come on. He doesn't even yeah, like man. it. He's so easily, yeah, he's so it. easily swayed, bro. Oh, we were at a, we were at dinner and uh, I, when, because I went on vacation with him to Beverly Hills. And we were, <laughs> of course, I'm not drinking all of 2020. So unless yeah. I find a, a problem with the Mayan calendar and say it's not actually 2020, I ain't fucking drinking. So I'm still going strong. <laughs> but we we're at this dinner. And dude, this kid hates going out. He doesn't want to go out so after worst. dinner. He loves, he, he, dinner's cool. We get to eat, we hang out for a little bit. But then, you know, Josie, Josie's, uh, she's, um, has a lot of friends here. Like she likes mm -hmm. to go out and, and, and she's be on the town, a social yeah. butterfly. And so she was like, you know, oh, there's this party happening at Nice Guy tonight. Uh, everybody's going to be there. Hissum, Flim, <laughs> Goy. I'm like, yo, you just named three names that aren't even fucking names. You know very well that none Catery, Gerb, Gerb, Hissum the whole the squad. <laughs> Hissum, which is like the sound a snake makes. Like, I'm just like, what are you saying? <laughs> and so she's like, yeah, man, everybody's going. I look at Amara and Amara is the exact opposite of Josie. No, no, neither of way is right like whatever you want to be uh -huh. i'm not i'm not passing a judgment but she's the exact opposite i look at amara and amara's just like this yeah. bring me home give me a big tt that's what she calls that big tt after she eats a lot and some ice cream i want to lay on the couch and watch movies wait like tea actual tea? uh tt like a t-shirt t a big t yeah, i want to put no, on a tt the biggest t-shirt you can find, find. Sure. and so that's what she wants to do but uh He's obviously an incredible boyfriend, very you know, giving to his his <laughs> lover. I, I say, I also wanted to go out. Oh, you did that yeah, night? Yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Just like I haven't been out in so long, like I I really do miss uh, being social. Yeah, and this it was nice. I wanted to go. I wanted to go because <laughs> when I first got you there, when we were dropping you off, I was like, I was like, you know, we're just gonna go home. You know, kick it, watch some TV. I mean, you guys could smoke out of the Rick and Morty bong I just bought you. And you, I saw your eyes lighting up. And then Josie was like, come on, Logan, let's go in. Because I, I also find as I'm growing up, like I'm I'm, a, I'm becoming more of an introvert, I think. I just think mm -hmm. like uh, as you get older, you can pinpoint the things you want in life. Mm -hmm. And being able to do that has made me realize also what I don't want. And although I did this particular night, I did, I did want to go out, but yeah. I mean, y'all know this, our circle's really tight. Our circle's one of the tightest, I think, in LA. Absolutely. Like talk to, talk to any TikTok house, vlog group, mm -hmm. uh, friends online. Most of them are dysfunctional, like in real life. Uh, spoiler alert, some of these people have beef within the group. Um, and, and it doesn't always, it's not always a well-oiled machine. It's ours, hard. Ours it's is. hard, yeah. Like we really like each other, and so I'm not yeah. always looking for like, like Jake said, no new friends type shit. Mm -hmm. I'm not on the wave, but also no new friends. Yep. So I, yeah, I, we, I tend to stay inside if given the opportunity. We've been like also trapped inside for three months, so I, you have to imagine that some sort of conditioning has happened where you're not like wanting that to too. go out. Oh, it's so true. You know, hey, that's such a good point. At all. Because you know, you know, I used to be obsessed with it. I would be yeah, out at hide sure. every night, yeah. you know, doing that whole thing. You would go even when you weren't drinking. Yeah, hundred percent. Because I was, I was literally addicted to it. I felt yeah. addicted to it. Like we would go to dinner and people would be like, "Yo, Hyde's gonna pop off after this, man." Fucking, uh, uh, uh Ghost of the Gram got fifty-two bottles of Ace coming out, <laughs> and I would just be like, "Damn, Ghost of the Gram's gonna be there." I gotta fucking go, dude. I'll be like. 
damn, I wonder who's going to be there. But why would I wonder? Because the same fucking people yeah, every fucking it, it, time. It, 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 and you're just standing against the wall. You're sweating. You're like, this is so fucking fun. Until you step back and realize it's not at I'm all. Not, I'm surprised. I'm not surprised that you like to go out. But I, th- I thought you'd get your partying out of the way. But I, I'm always like, okay, Logan still has a lot of partying to go to. I did all mine in college. You know, like yeah. I got mine out of the way. Mm. Right. But you never went, to, you went to college. You never partied in college. That's not, like when you have your, not only that, party I, time. I, I didn't party in college. I didn't party the first three years in LA. I was Wild. like, I, no, no party, no drink, mm-hmm. no, uh, no smoking. It just it's like head down. And so now I'm like, I'm pretty comfortable. And I'm also really big on, uh, balancing work and play. Mm. Like I really like balance is huge. If mm. I don't, if I don't, uh, recover, rest, have a little fun here and there, I, I will implode. Yeah. I, I mean, I say this all the time. It's just like, I, I, I like, I like being able to work hard and play hard. And I do. Yeah. And I think, I think the way you've started playing has been much more, uh, uh, helpful in your, in your career, similar, similar to, similarly to how it has for mine. Yeah. Like it is no, uh, anomaly or random situation that people are making videos about how you're going to be the most successful person in the entire world ever, you know, (laughs) like, like, like this year, because of our decision to stop fucking around, even more importantly, to get seven, eight hours of sleep a night. Yo, that's like the biggest part. The big, 100%, high, dude. When you guys go out, you go out until 4 a.m. and then you go to the after party and then you get home at seven or eight. Not, I mean, not, not always, night, but you know, man. like that's typically what happens. And then you're screwed for the next two days. And then you wake up on Monday and you're like, wow, my life sucks. I, I always said that it was never the hangover that was messing me up. It was the lack of sleep. Yeah. Like it was, it was the fact that I was getting two, three, four hours of sleep a night. Now when I get my eight hours of sleep or nine or seven or whatever, I wake up, my anxiety is, is reduced. Mm-hmm. I'm ready to get the day done exercise at the end of a long day, still have the energy for that. And everything's yeah. is moving, you know, as it should be, but, um, not blacked out on a Tuesday. Yeah. It's, it's yeah, exactly. The hangovers fuck me up. I'm, I'm not, some people just aren't good with them. Jake's not good with them either. Like <laughs> I, I'm, I'm almost either. crippled for the entire day. Do you do any like hangover prevention the night before? Or do you I, just like, I, I do this, this night it. wasn't, uh, so crazy. crazy. Yeah. Like normally I'll do like two shots full, uh, bottle of water, two shots, full bottle of water. We got yeah. kind of sidetracked. Josie and I were dancing. I like uh, dancing. Yeah. You know, she likes dancing. We're dancing. If you could do one water per drink, Mm-hmm. You you probably can eliminate a hangover you'll the next right, day. You'll right. you, you, you you might be like perfect. Bro, I, I always I wake even up drink to that beat much, though. Yeah, but Five. you haven't been drinking. That's why. Five six shots though. But I shouldn't. I should not have been a hungover. I'm a bitch, bro. But to be honest, I'm a pussy. Hmm. <clears throat> well, you're back. You just got back into it too. Your tolerance is extremely low when you take. I mean, when you take a decent amount of time she off. Call or, me a lightweight. It's, it's, it's not a problem. Man. Not a bad thing. Save money. Save time. You know. I hate yeah. to upset the you know the red solo cup drinking you know, tailgaters that watch the show. Cause I know there are a lot of them and shout out to those people. Like I've been one my whole life. Oh, yeah. This concerts. is just, yeah. Like this is just the new, you know, I don't, I don't try to tell people how to fucking live. This is just who I am now and how I, how I, how I choose to live well, my you're, life. You're a best you know selling author, dude. Like when you walk in a room, people look at you. <laughs> you're not, you're not, you're not the drug addict anymore. 